Hey, welcome to my home office. My name is John Weinberg with Photo48.com and today we're gonna to do something a little bit different. I wanna talk about what's been going on and what gear I'm using for this uh, kind of office studio setup that I'm gonna be using. It has been raining here in Sonoma County pretty hard for the last couple of weeks. We had some flooding last week. Uh, there were some areas of the West County that were hit really hard. People have lost their homes and businesses. Uh, my heart goes out to everybody affected by that. It's a pretty tough situation. Sonoma County is really tough and strong and will bounce back, uh, but it's definitely impacting a lot of people in a negative way, and, and I hope that they recover soon. And uh, any help that you can give them, I'm going to link to some uh, donation pages you can check out that we can help out the people of the West County. So if you have a chance, check those out. Uh, but because of all of that, I haven't really been able to get uh, out and about to do any videos. And I had to come up with some type of indoor space. So my wife and kids were kind enough to paint the back wall and the dresser below it. Uh, they're amazing. I couldn't do any of this without their love and support. And they did an amazing job on that. And I'm really happy with the way it turned out. It is perfect. So I got the idea from Ted Forbes. Uh, watching his videos, I like the color and the background that he was using. And, uh, you know, imitation is the sincerest form of flattery, right, Ted? So there you go. And then also, yeah, he had another video regarding use of a paper lantern for lighting. So I got a 30-inch paper lantern with a 100-watt LED bulb inside of it, and that is providing all the lighting for uh, this space. Uh, other than the lamp that's on the dresser behind me, that is it. Uh, and that was a video that Ted had, I think it was about three years ago. And uh, I figured I'd try that out. I'm on a budget and don't really have the money for, uh, you know, an advanced indoor lighting setup. Uh, so I'm hoping this is going to make do for the time being until I can get back outdoors. As for my gear, I'm using the Rode Video Micro, as always, on top of my Fuji X-T2. I do have the 18-55 to attached, uh, the lens. Uh, it's a great lens, perfect for B-roll and this type of situation. And it's a great walk around photography lens as well. I got it with my X-T1 when I switched over from Nikon to Fuji and I will never get rid of this lens. It's uh, it's kind of a staple in uh, my photography and videography uh, and will be going forward. So, so there's that. I'm going to go ahead and put the settings for all of this uh, below so you can check those out as well. Uh, but that is the gear I'm using and uh, you can check out those settings. If you see something that you think is just totally wrong and you think I could change something to make it better, feel free to drop me a comment. I'd love to hear it. Uh, anything I can do to make any of these better uh, helps all of us and makes these a little bit more watchable and a little bit more interesting. Uh, but yeah, that's uh, it's about that for now. I Let's see, I was in 26 episodes and then I did take a two-week break. Uh, it was nice to kind of not have to worry about things for a couple of weeks, uh, especially with all the rains going on and the flooding. Uh, it was uh, it was nice to relax a little bit, but I am back at it now. Uh, this is episode number 27, and I'll be doing weekly from here on out. Uh, if there's a video that you're interested in regarding Fuji gear, or regarding photography in general, uh, or videography, or how I'm making these videos, feel free to, once again, drop me a comment below, and uh, you never know, you might actually see that as a full-fledged video. So I look forward to hearing from you. Uh, Till next week, my name is John Weinberg with Photo48.com. You're never too old to start something new. Take care.